Alright, hey guys, it's been a while since I did an Arcane update video and a lot of stuff has been coming out recently. I've been waiting for the content to build so I don't content farm, but like, we got quite a bit to talk about. So first off, um, a Fortiche art book came out about the making of Arcane. And in, there's this one poster right here where you see that Jinx has a weird middle finger. Here's this, here's... Here's what it looks like close up. Um, a lot of people think Jinx is going to lose her middle finger, like Caitlyn shoots it off or something. I don't really think that's the case. This is an art book. Everything's super stylistic, and I don't think they're going to spoil such a major plot point just through an art book. So, uh, I mean, yeah, it looks weird. Maybe it's just a tattoo. Maybe it's just like part of her glove. I, I don't think it's a metal prosthetic. If you, if you are going to get metal prosthetic, it's just one finger. Is it that important? Like, the trigger finger is the pointer finger, okay? I can see if Jinx wants to get a metal prosthetic for that, but, like, yeah, this just seems kind of necessary, so take this with a grain of salt. Got this one season two poster. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, the only thing is different is that Ambessa has a... looks like a counselor outfit. I guess this plays into my theory where Ambessa takes up Mel's Madara seat in the council and starts leading it. But it's strange, because Ambessa gets, like, three outfits in Arcane. She gets her war outfit, her, like, normal season one outfit, and now this outfit. I think it's kind of sad because like Vi gets a new outfit and like Jinx is Jinx is nothing. We do, we are getting a new outfit for Jinx again. For a lot of shows, uh, season one, season two, characters get different outfits just because it's good for merchandising to differentiate the different seasons. So I'm really looking forward to Jinx getting an outfit, but I guess I mean it's just gonna be kind of sad seeing Jinx wear the same things over and over again. Who knows? Next poster, it's a Echo. Within his dreadlocks, he has this band. Uh, but it looks like a bullet casing and it has a Jinx painting on it. Again, I wouldn't think too much of it. The most important internal conflict for Echo is regarding Jinx. That's when we saw him fumble during the bridge seat. So obviously it's going to draw some relationships to Jinx and Echo, but I don't think this really confirms anything. Next off, we have um, an evil Caitlyn poster. Oh, my, my, I guess things are looking like my theory came correct, how Caitlyn turns evil. So, I mean, uh, another dub for me. But yeah, Caitlyn's going to be dead set on taking out Jinx, especially because uh, Jinx probably got her mother killed. And I really hope we get to see more investigative duties from Caitlyn. Post time skip, the first scene of Caitlyn we got was her like going through the Soko airship, piecing together everything that has happened. And I thought that was really cool. But then later throughout the series, Caitlyn's deductive abilities were mainly played in the background. I want to see Caitlyn take a greater role in the front stage and showcase off not only her marksmanship, but also her reasoning skills. But from the trailers, it looks like Caitlyn is going to be on that. So that's really great to see. And today, a new poster drop of Jinx upside down. And you see above that, it looks like Vi's glove choking Jinx out. So, I mean, another great poster. Is there, I don't think there's any other details for me to point out. Reddit didn't go crazy today with the analysis, so there's nothing for me to steal from them. I mean, we, we know Vi and Jinx are going to get into a conflict, and that's going to be cool. I would do like to mention that we've been getting posters every Tuesday. So maybe they'll keep doing that. And last thing to mention, we have a trailer in two days. Other than that, I will be live streaming the trailer when it drops. I will be live reacting to the trailer with everyone. I'm gonna wake up my roommates because I don't give a frick. And that should be it. I hope you guys stay tuned. Stay tuned for more stuff. I'm gonna release a video in like one day. Oh fuck, I don't know if that's possible. All right, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Nice to see we're getting more arcane content, right?